猜哪一个是女的？第三个是女生，最左边感觉有一点像女生，但是因为我看下面七号他的 package。他好像有包裹、欸。Dude on the right with the thumbs up is definitely a dude. 最左边那个。My man, I say he's a dude. Also the 第二，从左边第二位 is also a dude. 而且那个女生的骨盆 is more defined, whereas the guys, because guys don't really have hips, and also 他们的那个腹肌也比较比较明显。So just last week, two of these are they? I'm supposed to trans, huh? Want to be trans? They got kicked out by the athletics association. They were like, you fake ass women. <laughs> well, I said it for them. Oh yeah. <laughs> They were like, get out. Which is actually a strange coincidence, because just a few weeks before that, the American Athletics Commission banned transgender athlete Leah Thomas from competing in women's swimming. Dog, how long may you? She won a ton of awards, dude. And there was a lot of controversy surrounding Leah Thomas and whether or not she should be able to compete. So maybe this is more than just a coincidence. Maybe these two are actually linked, and perhaps there is a connection because it's two athletic commissions who made this decision. But this might all point to one single. Event possibly that kicked this shit off because just a few months ago the American State Senate had a hearing to decide what they should do about trans women in sports. At this moment, Tai Chi Tua Tiao Lo. Do I understand your position to be that there are two sexes, but there can be more than two genders? Um, I wouldn't even say two, and you know we've got Dr. Lopez here as well, but there's also the definition of intersex. I think that often in these conversations we're conflating sex and gender, and I do want to affirm here that trans women are are women. That is their gender. Homegirl Kelly Robertson is the president of Human Rights Association.、Yeah. This is like the Tsai Hong Tui Zhang Ba. She's the one who whispers in the president's ear, saying, "Hey, give them rights. Hey, don't give them rights. Hey, these people are important. Trans women are women, yo." <laughs> She says it definitively. This hearing is trying to figure out how they should distribute the rights for trans women in sports.、Yeah. So this is extremely important, and everyone's cooperation is also extremely important. <laughs> Keep that in mind. But, but I'm trying to. Understand? Do you make a distinction between sex and gender? Yes, sir. Okay. Explain that. Just. Do you think there are more than two sex? That's quite dangy. Oh, I can explain. He's he's a Western person, and he's old school. For them, this type of is really very hard. For them, this type of is really 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 hard. For Oh. But your gender is what they say you can have unknown numbers. So, 以前他们两个是合在一起的嘛 Sex and gender. 以前 like 算我的年代 and before it was like we just assumed that sex and gender were the same thing. But now it's kind of separated. Now it's like okay, well, gender could be fluid. It changes. It's influenced by society. Society made that shit up. So gender、right? is more like on the paper. Sex is more like under your pen. <laughs> Correct. But I want to start with sex. Okay, there's male, there's female. When a baby's born, before the baby has had time to even have a sense of self, there's male, female, and intersex. There's a third. So I believe that is true, but I would defer to Dr. Lopez as I'm not a physician. She keeps deferring to the doctor, but she's like the president of human rights.、Yeah. Did you not talk to your doctor before you came up here? <laughs> I'm not a doctor, but I know when I pull my pants down to take a piss, that's my dick, dog.、Yeah. <laughs> um, <笑>他宕机了，我以为是那个嘞。哎<笑>、欸，因为你要想他的角度，他是来这边要把事情解决，所以他真的不知道怎么一直问一样的问题，但是要把它改成是那个妹妹可以理解。<笑> God damn it! I think the gender is expansive, and the definitions are always growing. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> you can literally replay. I think my dick is expansive, and. <laughs> Its reach is always growing, depending on the situation or the day, or even the temperature outside. Yeah, especially in the morning. So you can take out gender and put anything in there. It will、yeah. be that way. Are there more than five? I wouldn't subject myself to naming how many genders there are, but what I can say is there are an infinite. Excuse me. There's an infinite number of genders. 
I think depending on your culture, there are a lot of different genders that, that exist. Oh, no. evolving. This is actually a common thing that people try to use. They say, oh, multiple gender. Yeah. This is true, but the maximum is actually three. She's talking about like uh, the Native Americans, they have two spirit, right? There are some Aboriginal cultures, even Thai culture as well. They have male, they have female, and then they have another version, which is what they call intersex, where they might switch in between the two based on their identity. Look at young people today. They really don't lean into the binary of only woman and man. So I think that it's incumbent upon us not to legislate on this, but create space for them to explore what their identities are, what their gender identities are. I, I think I understand what you're saying. There are three sections, male, female, and intersex. I believe that to be true, but again, I'm not a physician. And there are an infinite number of gender, oh, totally. because gender is a mental state. Gender is about expression, and I think that there are a variety of ways that you can express your gender. I express myself as Batman. Yeah. <laughs> you see the person on the right? He fell asleep. Yeah. <laughs> and the guy on the left is like, this shit. <laughs> All right, let's go back to the to the bio. Male, female, boy. Male, free male. Okay. Biological. Do males have an advantage over females biologically in sports? Again, I'm not a physician and I, I can't speak to that. What's your real world experience? Um, it depends. I mean, there are some people who are born male that I'm faster than if I were to sprint against them and some that I'm not. Some males that are taller than some that that women. Don't some believe that a biological male has a physical advantage in sports over a biological female? Not as a, a definitive statement. Word? Then let Mike Tyson go compete in women's boxing, dog. <laughs> yeah. See how that works out. Give me an example. Well, no, I, I don't think. I don't think. I don't think. I don't I don't believe that yeah. there's anything I can say. How many female members of the NBA do you see? Well, I can say that, you know, there's been this news article about men that think that they could beat Serena Williams in tennis, right? That they think that they could actually score a point on her. Um, and it's just not the case. She is stronger than that. So after this very unproductive conversation, my man is about to pivot to another woman who was actually there competing with Leah Thomas and had her medals taken by the transgender athlete. And this is none other than Riley Gaines. What's your experience, Ben? Both Serena and Venus lost to the 203rd ranked male tennis player, which they're phenoms for women. Uh, <laughs> swam at University of Kentucky as well. In terms of accolades and in terms of national ranking, I was a much better swimmer than him. Um, he could kick my butt any day of the week without trying. Wow. So in theory, this could have been the mic drop moment that let the whole world really in the psychology. She has like, oh, shit. maybe we should configure and rethink how we actually approach this thing. And this is what probably led to the whole China situation and also to the Leah Thomas getting banned from the swimming thing. Yeah. But now, just recently, the World Aquatics Commission in Germany has officially opened a new category specifically for trans women to compete. This is an epic moment for sports. But yeah. what about beauty pageants, dog? Because yeah. Miss Universe is coming up, and Miss Netherlands is going to be competing in this competition. Oh, Sidon, how much you can be? Don't run out. Don't I think the Thailand people win. Actually, that should be an unfair competitive advantage. See, when top of them, the soul is not too strong. Yeah. Like, it's ridiculous. I think If you're a trans woman because of your bone structure, you actually have a disadvantage, I would imagine. Good night. Because your your shoulders are wider, you've got bigger legs. I and... have a lot of Harry Potter. <laughs> 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 Minimus. 